Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Have you ever photographed the Milky Way? You spent probably a few hours out in the dark, in the cold, photographing the Milky Way. You came back home, you have gone through all the trouble of stitching the images together, stacking them together to reduce noise, processing them in Photoshop to boost up the contrast and everything. And finally you came up with an image looking like this. Look at this terrible gradient of light pollution laying on the horizon. This yellow color, it looks terrible. What if I told you that in a very few simple steps in Adobe Photoshop, you can actually burn down all this light pollution and come up with a clean image like this. If you want to know how to do it, don't stop watching. Okay, so we are now in Photoshop and I'm going to show you step by step how you can remove this layer of light pollution here on the horizon and come up with a final image looking like this. So let's delete these adjustments for now and let's do it from scratch. So I'm going to show you two ways how to do it. First one is using a paid plugin called Lumenzia, which you can see is this panel right here on the top right corner. It's an amazing plugin created by a photographer named Greg Benz. I'm going to Put some links to it down in the description so you can check it out but it's a very powerful plugin definitely worth its price and then i'm going to show you an alternative method how you can achieve a very similar effect without any additional plugins so first let's use lumensia we're going to target those yellows here on the horizon so click on the yellow swatch and then click on the light swan this will create a preview of a mask we're going to accentuate on the yellows by making those gray parts a bit more white so the selection is stronger so open the levels properties and then bring the slider to the left somewhere around here is fine then go back to Lumenzia and select the color balance adjustment just click on it we're going to collapse our blend and then open the properties of the color balance and bring the yellow blue slider all the way to the blue now you can see that the yellows are gone but we introduced some red cast. So we're going to go to minus 30 towards the cyan to remove the red. And also maybe plus 10 on the magenta green. And these are the values I used. Also we can select preserve luminosity for a better effect. And this is basically a very good result. The only thing we need to do is mask out this house which is on the left bottom corner because the lights of the house are casting a tongue scent light I want to bring it back because it's natural to have some kind of cast over the house so let's hit this button to create a group and then put the adjustment layer inside the group then click the group again click the mask button here select the brush tool by hitting the B key select the default color set black and white by hitting the D key and then by clicking the X key make sure that black is selected as foreground color bring the flow all the way to 100 percent and make sure the hardness is at zero percent then just place the brush over the house make it big enough maybe even bigger and then just dab once this will create a perfect circle gradient of a yellow tungsten cast over the house and we are basically done now i'm going to show you a second method which is without using lumenzia so let's hide this adjustment for now and let's use a hue saturation adjustment so here hue saturation we're going to select yellows and bring down lightness to around i think i used minus 73 or something you can see that most of the yellows are gone but we're going to also desaturate it so something around minus 50 saturation and basically all the yellow is gone but we can do better on top of the hue saturation adjustment we can actually use a selective color again select yellows and then just bring them down somewhere around here as we can see we got rid of the yellow color cast but the yellow color generated by the house is gone even more so we're going to bring it back select both adjustment layers hit the group button and then use the same trick so add a layer mask select the brush make sure that black color is selected and just dab once here bringing back the yellow color cast of the house 
And that's basically it. I've shown you two methods how to do it. One is with a paid plugin called Lumenzia. I highly recommend you check it out. Again, links are in the description down below. If you don't want to spend money on Lumenzia, I have shown you an alternative method. I think that the method using Lumenzia produces a more organic result. But let me know down below in the comments what do you think about it. Which result do you prefer? I hope this video helped you. If it did, hit that like button down below. It really makes a difference. Also, you can subscribe to the channel because there will be more tutorials like this coming up. That's it for now. Have a nice day and I will see you next time. Bye.